Good morning, everybody. Yeah, I didn't check in last night. Made it about 75 miles. Um, just crashed, had some troubles along the way. Uh, one was I didn't hydrate properly. The second was about 15 miles from here. I hit some stickers. That's what we call them as kids. Some people call them thorns, but either way, they punctured both uh, tubes just simultaneously. So that's two tubes out. I got one left. And uh, so I chose to ride on the road the rest of the way. That slowed me up and man, I was, I was tired. Anyways, this is a great place to stop. Uh, that's gonna change some plans because I just don't have the puncture proof tires, nor do I have the uh, tubes to be able to continue. I, and I do not want to get stuck somewhere and have to walk this bike forever. So I'm going to head back today. I'll check probably in town to see if there's an extra tube or two I can grab. But uh, that's the plan for today. Survive the night. It is cold, 42 degrees right now, and uh, hopefully warming up. It looks like it's on track to be a gorgeous day. The good news is we've got coffee. We're having ourselves some uh, breakfast. We're hydrating a breakfast pack and seeing how that goes and getting ready to uh, let things um, warm up just a shade, dry up just a shade, and uh, have some breakfast, and then pick up camp and head out. We'll check you on the road. proof tires puncture proof tubes on the way back I had two more punctures thank you for slime filling those I could make it back because I didn't have any more tubes um, going going out was rough I think generally there's two there's a few reasons for that generally coming back southeast is generally easier from what I understand never mind the fact that this time I had a um, crosswind that mostly worked in my favor. I learned from yesterday that I did not fuel and hydrate well, so I planned that better this time. Uh, and I took adequate breaks instead of just trying to grind through. That did not serve me. So I definitely learned a ton, even though it didn't work out the way I'd planned. Had a lot of fun, I'm not gonna lie. The first day, there were moments it was miserable. Um, speaking of lessons, I learned that I'm camping in 42 degree weather is not my favorite thing. But I wouldn't have learned any of that, nor would I have gained the good things if I hadn't have done that. Once time, one, once, once time, <laughs> one time somebody gave me a sheet of paper and it had a circle on it with the words or letters t-u-i-t -T. and i looked at him and i said what in the world is that and he said well don't you know it's around to it 
I said, why do I need that? He says, because every once in a while you say, if I get around to it. Well, now you got around to it. A lot of times that's the way it is with our lives. We don't get around to the things we think are really important. We put them on the list to do. Well, like he taught me, let me encourage you. Get around to it. Set aside the excuses. Do whatever it is that thing that you would pl been planning to do. Do it. And live life. That's all.